Hey everybody, I'm Crow, and welcome back to Paper Mario, the Origami King. If you stand here for long enough, Mario actually falls asleep. Was doing a bunch of audio testing. Mario got sleepy. He couldn't wait up for me. Eh. You don't say. Oh. I saw in the recording that I missed up here. But, uh... It's just fast travel. That's... Honestly super cool. Like, I say just fast travel, but it's like... We're over here now. Can I get over this? That totally looks like something I could get to. Anyway, there's still a bunch of Goombas. So we gotta smack some Goombas. Still a bunch of houses. I don't think we gotta smack the houses, but we're probably gonna. Save me! <laughs> I think I'll fix this house first. We have more pressing matters to attend to. Oh, I actually have to go into the house. Lol. Cool! That reminded me of something. I don't know what. What video game would that be? Where would little hearts fly out? It had to have been a Mario game, right? It's gonna bother me forever now. Oh no, door is locked, right? Or no, it's blocked. That's why we have to go through the window. I saw the window, but I was like, I gotta check everything else in this room. Otherwise, what if we have to come back in this room again? Backtracking, man. Hello, Goomba. You are so weak in paper mache. You're doing it! See, this shy guy? He believes in us. Or is it a shy gal? I can't tell. If anyone could defeat the world's largest and most disgusting Goomba, I knew it'd be you, Mario. I came here to deliver dinner, and in a weird way, that's exactly what I did. But Red Shy Guy is off the menu, thanks to you, Mario. I really owe you one. Shy Guys look cool. I'm glad that we could help them. The door is probably operable now, but at the same time, I have a box. And as all people with boxes, they can jump over fences. Provided the box happens to be near said fence. Is there secrets over here? I bet there's secrets. There was secrets. It was in the form of money. Watermill. I love the paper water on that. Absolutely adore it. There's like three sheets of paper water just sitting on each one. The paper aesthetic, very good. I understand that the old games were more... Whoa. He actually came from in front of us, but he still almost got us. They were more RPG-ish. And that's why they'll always have a special place in my heart. Honestly, this game seems super awesome so far. Visually amazing. For, you know, Paper Mario game. Like, it's so papery and Mario-y. Maybe because I, I miss Sticker Star and stuff. But you have to use cards in those combat systems, and that's really lame, because I hated Chain of Memories. It's a book! The Origami Festival is almost here. I'm so excited. I'm writing notes to myself. Aw, whose house was this? Yo, what's in here? I know you got the goods. Steak. Get back, you paper mache monster! Oh, it's you! It's the Goombas we saved earlier, isn't it? Thanks for saving us earlier. Here's a little something for the effort. I'm getting the mental image of walking into little hearts like that, but I can't remember what game that is. Yeah, we're just gonna play it safe and stay here forever-ish. Good luck, Mario! Lol at actually having to pull that open. I hope they don't let the, the steak and wine go to, go to waste. It's very high quality, very expensive. Very shame if cow died for nothing.
I gotta get you out of there, bud. Hey, thanks for that. I owe you one. Oh, but I can pay you back right now with information. If you're trying to get to Peach's castle, you can take the sewer over there. Graffiti Underground, Toad's Town Entrance. Technically, it's a sewer. I was kind of really hoping that this was just going to say that sewer over there, exactly like how the shy guy said it. But then they didn't. There's a hook here. I see that hook on the wall. Would they put a hook here for no reason? Secret Ultra Mega Boss later on. What? The bridge is broken! Now how are we going to get to Peach's Castle? It's not like we can just jump in an underground tube, travel through it somehow, and pop out on the other side, can we? Cough, cough, tube. Nah, too spacious. Plus, we've got other people to save, and other holes to fill. We're not going to Peach's Castle until we can fill in all this stuff. Get booped on. We're gonna have 10,000 coins for the first time we go ever go to a store. And we're probably going to be, like, dude, that's probably, like, half of what a mushroom costs. We could actually, like, get into the store and then just look at all the things that we can't afford to buy. Hmm. Oh, is this really tight platforming? I, I know I, yeah, look, I'm up on top of it now. There's no way it's actually that hard. Oh, this is that center area. Did we already get most of the town, then? I think we're actually close to done with this. What is behind door number one? Eh, there's a bunch of confetti. We're already loaded. We're filthy rich with confetti. It was a combat! It's been a while since we had one of those. Ooh, so they make you pick. No, never mind. They didn't make me pick nothing. One of them just jumped, and the other one just slid. I assume this is going to get more difficult later. Not that it needs to. If they want to keep giving me the easy wins, that's fine. Since we don't level up, there's no real reason to grind. Outside of money, I guess. There's 268 coins for that. And then extra after? That's pretty nice. I, I enjoy the monies. How much we have makes me think that the inflation in Toad Town is insane. I wonder how much a gold coin's going for in Daisy's Kingdom right now. That's super suspicious. Don't trust the Yellow Toad. Has unfolded arms. Gimme. Nice. Cause I was like, yeah, there's there's gotta be one more. Like I saw at least one more big in over here. We tear this off and the stairs fall down. Cause like I'm sure someone really good probably could have done that. Just actually jumped up those, but that seemed like very difficult. Oh, really? You're going to be locked on me. Well, maybe I have to defeat this Goomba first. One of these days, they're going to get me. But that day is not today. I mean, actually, it might be. But probably not this episode. I'll spare you the details, but know this. I am Sniffit. And I was inside that Goomba. Do you have any idea what it was like in there? Never mind. Just take this and try to forget what happened to me. Think nothing of that gift. It's a mere trinket. After all, this home was built with proceeds from a lucrative confetti sales operation. There are big coins in the confetti business. Come see me anytime, and I will sell you the finest luxury confetti you've ever had the pleasure of scattering. 
Do you feel that, Mario? It feels calmer somehow. It's almost like there aren't any more giant monsters trying to eat buildings. And us! Come back when out. It's literally 300 gold coins for confetti. Literally 300. How do I get into this house? Is there a key that I'm missing? Well, I got nothing. I tried hitting everything in that house. I did remember, no, though, that there is something over here. Wait, do you have a key? Those horrible giant Goombas showed up right around the time the toads disappeared. I heard loud noises coming from Princess Peach's castle, too. Just what is going on? Oh, you thought I was a red shy guy. Well, sorry to disappoint, but I'm a sniff it. No, you're already facing this direction. I'm fine, and I'm glad I saved you, but... Do you know how to get that door open? Because I tried, like, all the things, and it didn't really work. That wasn't the right button. I wanted a map, but then I remembered that there is no map. Well, this probably isn't going to do anything. Oh, it was back to this one. We did need a save block. What is our... No, Olivia. I understand. What is our block completion? Not so bottomless holes. There's only one left. Does that mean that it's actually in town and I missed it? Oh ho! 100 coins. And there's a fence thingy over here. So we did need to come back to this part of town. I'm just looking for that dead last hole. I don't want to mess a hole. Hey, it actually opened. The dock. You're on it. Sorry I missed you, albeit Autumn Mountain until the winds change. See, Captain Toad. Alright, well, I'm assuming the hole is over there. And then we gotta go through the sewers to get to it, because I don't see it anywhere. I did another once around. Totaling A once around, anyway. And I didn't see nothing. So we're probably good. I think maybe. Oh, I forgot to mention that you need a special manhole hook to get down there. I think my friend is using it right now. Just look for the red shy guy like me. But not quite as handsome. Oh, that's why there's two Sniffets. And they're like, haha, you thought I was a shy guy. I'm like, no, I didn't think anything. I just saw a big Goomba and I killed it. And I saved you expecting a reward and you gave me nothing, so time to die. Lol. I came here to deliver dinner, and that's exactly what I did. But red shy guys off the menu really thank you. Hold on. You're red. Just like that other shy guy. And nearly as handsome. So, do you have the thing we need to open the sewer lid? I don't know what you're talking about. But that hook isn't here. Check out the red brick building at the port. That's where I left it. Oh, thank you. Should we go check it out, Mario? I mean, it's better than sitting around here. And if I remember right, there's even a pipe that can take us over there. But that pipe takes us back to this pipe, so it's not this pipe. I think it's that pipe. Fast travel pipe ho! Hey, dude, where'd you put the thing? You think something's in there? Could be. Seemed like those folded guys were messing around in here forever. Gimme. Gimme. Oh, that hammer of yours sure can shake things up. Did those boxes just move? Keep doing that. Hit it again. Oh, we tearing this place up. Bug. Hmm, Goombas, you say. Hmm. More like I attack you with hammer. So if there's just multiple enemies in the area, it's a wave bottom? I'm okay with that. That's even more money. Oh no. How will I ever line these up? 
Ah, I am slain. I expire. Boop, 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 boop. See, how are people going to say that this combat isn't, like, way better than the other games? I so I'll just have to... How do I change the ring select? That one. Look, we put him on the other side this time. Completely changed our perspective. The toads are completely odd. Their lives changed forever. No one has ever done that before. 546 gold. Plus even more gold. I know they're coins, but they're still golden coins. And as such, they are now medieval currency. I gotta push this. I feel like I could push this. I pushed it. Let me just come over here. Get the monies first. There's totally something in there. I can see it. Maybe I gotta get this first? Maybe I gotta get that first? You got a mushroom! This has given me, like, deja vu something else, too. Curse Monkey Island? I don't know. Played some individual games, man. Anywho, we got the thing to do. So now I can jump back in the pipe of instant gratification. Or at least semi-instant. It's not quite instantaneous. But I press the A button and then we whoosh over there. Past the item shops, past the accessory shops and the badge shops and all the things that I want shops. Hey, we did it though. 10,000 coins. This is what happens when you skip no battles. I was gonna hit the save block, but I mean, what are the odds that we go in there and there's just a huge boss fight that instantly wipes me? Item has been selected. I'm surprised it didn't explode. Why would it explode, you ask? Because it's a video game, and everything explodes in video games. Even explosions explode in video games. Ah, it's so dark in here. Why does everyone seem to like this place so much? Can you turn on the lights, Mario? Otherwise, it'll be dark all the way through this place. Yeah, that's really nice. Also, I'm fixing this. This is a completely different area, isn't it? This is entirely a different area. I don't believe... So this is what it looks like beneath the town. It's actually cute. But I wonder where it connects up with Peach's Castle. This is totally a different area, isn't it? This is totally a different area. Graffiti Underground. We get things that track all this stuff later. I wanted to at least get all the not-so-bottomless holes, but... Perhaps too much of the town is locked away. What if that whole area is like Peach's Castle is probably another another area? Ah, jeez. There's only five holes in here. That's okay. That looks really cool. Really cool. Mario's trying to hug her. It's not because I pressed the wrong button. He just really misses Peach. I forgot that I can't read keybind anything. Look, someone's here. Who's there? Yes, I'm saved! Oh, Mario, I had to run down here and hide from those horrible folded soldiers. Pardon me, I should introduce myself. I'm the curator of Muse Champignon in Toad Town. Gotta, I hate it when I can't pronounce things. It's a museum with a splendid collection of objects, music, treasures, origami, and other wondrous items. And we've even managed to acquire the legendary Supermarino Sea Vessel, believe it or not. I do hope you'll come visit soon. We're open. Even with all of the orgamized crime we've seen of late. You see, Marino, I'm trying to remember those words instead of that toad's face. It just kept getting closer. It was all I could focus on, but maybe the words were more important. We should go back to town and check out the musee. 
Whatever that is. I mean, sure, we could do that. But first, I got some bats to fight. We ain't never fought these bats before. Okay. I literally just pressed down and hey, that's all I had to do. One, two, three, four. I missed one. I wonder if we get less money for that. Boop, 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 boop. Did it work? I closed my eyes. 269, so they're only worth like 20 gold more. Did I hit him or did they hit me? Got him. That was wrong. Toggle. Like that. Boop, 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 and boop. Oh, jeez, are they gonna get an attack? Oh, no, wait, never mind. We do have two actions. I was like, wow, is this actually combat? It's like, nope. Mario is too powerful. He just does 48 damage in one attack, and then he's like, I'm gonna do another 48 damage. And they're like, but what will we do against 96 damage? And he was just like, absolutely nothing. Suffer before the wrath of Mario's quick math. I can't remember what the bats are called. I know the bloopers are bloopers, but... The bats probably aren't called bats. Mario has, like, cute names for everything. It's not Dark Cloud. I can't remember what game it is of these little hearts. I was thinking of Luigi's Mansion. That's what I was thinking of. It was definitely Luigi's Mansion. I'm so glad I figured that out instead of forgetting it forever. Oops, I had the wrong button. Want to do that. And then pull them up, and then do that, and then pull them up. That's what I wanted to do. My B. I will always hit wrong buttons. Get 14 and then get 14 again. Like the button to switch whether I'm going between like a row and a and a ring. I always want to hit the wrong button there. I paid the toads 10 coins when we didn't have to. That's pretty cool that they threw stuff at him though. Give me the money. I demand it. Pay me. I'm the hero. Shouldn't I have, like, all the money? Like, actually all the money from every other adventure? Ack, it's so dark in here. Why does everyone seem to like this place so much? Can you turn on the lights, Mario? Otherwise it'll be dark all the way through this place. Tell me those are blue coins and not just coins that happen to be underwater. Hey, there's a pipe over there. I wonder where it leads. I bet you can hardly contain yourself when you see a pipe that inviting, huh? Oh no, it's all flooded. We can't get across with all that water there. We'd get soggy. Hmm, so now water bed. Well, I guess we're gonna have to go around. So I think next time... We're going to go around. I mean, I don't know what else we would do. So thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you liked it. Later, everybody.